In the last few days I was building my base and I had a few visitors. So I had a cowman. I also had an armsy and a Virginia. I actually had a few armsies and a few of them were blue. So the game is ramping up the base. Another real thing. Today I reload the game and my plane X, even though it doesn't let me do any more upgrades. It doesn't have the upgrades that it used to have. So now. Okay, this one took one hit. But uh, with this plane X I upgraded. Oh. Now it's working. A little while ago I was uh, having to do two hits on those thick trees to be able to cut them down. For some reason the upgrade just disappeared. I don't know what's going on. So, I'm almost done here. I'm not going to be able to do the staircase as I planned to. But I'm going to keep building. I'm going to put a roof and let's continue from there. Just a quick check on my stats. It's doing very good. My strength is almost at 29. So the athleticism is up, and I actually gain one pound. I have no idea what it means, because my strength of athleticism are still going up. So, I think we're good. As you can see, I got two creepy armors in reserve, and I'm wearing five. So, I've been having quite a bit of mutants, because I was working on this, collecting more sticks, filling up my log storage, and I got plenty of logs for now. So now let's think. I was gonna do the staircase going this way and another going this way. So now it's gonna work. So uh, one option that I got is just do a staircase on this side because I would like to keep this open to do some zip lines going over there to be able to go to the arrows camp and to other places. Um, I would like to have this room for stick holders and rock holders, and I would like to have many of them. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do here. One option would be to do a crane right here. And this would be pretty good, because I don't think the cannibals or the mutants can use it. So having a crane, I just could have just a hole on, on the roof and just go up with the crane. The thing is, it takes a little while. And the stairs are just much faster. And it seems like I got visitors downstairs. There they go. They keep training for the marathon. Yeah, they always got somewhere to go. And they cross each other and they don't even stop to say, good, to say hello. Look at that. I think this one saw me. I don't know if it's a good idea to try to jump for the water. But I'm gonna try anyway. Here goes nothing. Not even close. Jesus. <laughs> But I didn't die. It is okay. So these the, the SNM guys are probably here. No. That's the thing. If I throw arrows on there, I'm not going to be able to get them back. And uh, I think I'm going to close this off with the uh, defensive walls around here. Because I'm not sure, but I think they hit this thing already. Even though it doesn't say that I had to fix it. Let me just take one of these pills. I think it must be better. These little guys are the annoying ones, man. Oh boy, they're so really fast. Let's see if I can melee him. Oh, see? He's really that fast. There you go. Two hits. Come on, buddy. Let's do this. Wanna dance? Let's run. No, oh, he almost got drawn. <laughs> oh, too slow. There you go. We lost one tooth. Two heads in once. Nice. Getting kind of hungry now. Oh. Oh, good one. You got moves too. Very cool. It's like with Tango, with blood on your faces. Another tooth, another jump, another hit. There you go. It sure takes a while, a while to bring him back, doesn't it? Let's keep doing this a little bit more. I like it. Oh. Jesus. I, I thought I heard someone coming from behind. 
Okay, so I'm not sure if this thing is upgraded as I did. It's taking a while now. Come on, man, keep swinging the thing. Jesus. It really sh is just a shitty thing for. Let's try this one. Okay, I think this one is a little bit better. Pretty cool thing, in this big old lake, in this little corner, some fish seem to spawn. Which is really not nice. Got one. And... I think I saw another one. There he is, really close. Jesus, dude. I don't know where you're going, but you're gonna go into my drone rack. That's where you're going. I don't know how he does it, but there's a deer inside the water. And I don't think he's got an oxygen tank. But... <coughs> He's down for the count. So I guess this lake is not very good for fish, but it's pretty good to find deer. And I don't think I'm going to be able to retrieve him inside the water, unfortunately. Oh, I can. Nice. Oh, that was lucky. There you go. So let me try again on another stick tree. Because this is weird. This never happened before. Like, the, the upgrades completely disappear. Okay, now it's working with one hit. But once I reloaded the game, I would... I, I, I needed to take two hits to take these things down. And it doesn't seem like much, but it's a big difference. <laughs> it's a really big difference. Being able to cut down those little trees with just one hit. Oh, that's awesome. There you go. Let's just put this meat right here. I still don't have any dry racks on that side. Uh, I'm gonna have to stop building it as fast as I can. So I got some more water here for later. But the water collector is full, so let's stop doing the roof and I'll figure out the stairs later. I'm not gonna build these two walls for now. I'm just gonna install the roof and continue from there. So let's just see. If I just put it like that, it covers the whole thing. And then later, I can always just make a hole. So how many logs is that? 38. Is it downstairs or upstairs? I have no idea. Can't really see down. That's the a little bit of a downside. It wouldn't be a bad idea to have a crane right here. To actually be able to go down there and come back up. It would be much faster than having to go around. Also, if I engage with a few cannibals or mutants on here, and I get blooded, I need to go down to the water. So that should be a good way to go down. The thing is, this is a little high, and it would be nice if the crater wood came all the way from the floor to the first floor. And so I could use the crane to come in and out of the base. So in fact, I think I'm going to build a roof like this, and I'm gonna, not going to need to do a hole at all. If the crane doesn't work, I just put another platform right here and the set of stairs coming from the outside. So it's just 38 locks. I should have them right here. And this is the fastest thing I ever built. Look at that. That's awesome. I usually make tall roofs. And there we go. I got myself a roof. But I think this is pretty good. It's good enough. The only thing that I don't like is that I actually have to jump here. I wish this was a little bit better, because now I'm going to bang my head. It's just a little bit a quality of life thing, you know? So these walls, yeah, I think these are going are gonna to work here. Let's put them in. So I had to add... I didn't finish this one, okay. I had to add a little bit more. Because it wasn't going but uh, it's not in the same alignment it's vertical but uh, that's fine it's closed that's pretty good so now uh, this is just gonna be for storage but for wood and sticks and stuff like that and rocks I'm not gonna keep the food storage down here so in fact I'm gonna try to go down and I can line it up the crane with the platform itself and then I can come here and try to jump and put it in Let's see if it works. Look what you've become. Yeah, that's a shame. So let's see. And I can always do the defensive walls later on. So I got the door right there. So let's try to put the crane in. I think it's over here. There you go. And uh, I have no idea if it's lined up. 
It's kind of hard to see. It seems kind of okay. It seems kind of okay. So now it's going to be tricky to turn the liner up with that thing on top. Of course, the crane is a little bit bigger. Oh, of course I do. And it's a full gang. Oh boy. Okay, at least the big boss is out. Are those ones coming? Let's make a big pile right here. See if they get the point. Oh, they got the fire guy. I don't think the fire guy knows I'm here. The fire guy is always white guy. He's always painted white. And he's out. Another one screaming guy. I don't have red paint to do that. What are, what are you doing? Yeah. That's pretty simple solution right here. So let's keep piling. And the deer wants to be in too. I think deer are vegetarians. But uh, you never know. In a cannibal world, anything can happen. That's a huge pile of bones if I haven't seen one. Okay, let's try it now. Let's see if it will be possible. So, in terms of alignment, it seems kind of okay. The issue was going to be to put it close enough. It's kind of hard to see, so it's like there. I don't want it to be completely in. And uh, yeah, the, the entrance is a little bit smaller, so I'm going to go for it. So I'm going to put it there, and now, yeah. But if I go higher, I should be able to raise the crane a little bit more. I did this once in another later. It worked, but let's see. It's going to be tricky to give it the correct height. So there you go. I'm actually able to pull it. Oh, look at that. It seems like it's kind of glitching with the... Let's put it. And it broke something. Holy moly. It was a little in, wasn't it? But it just broke the wall. I should be able to put the wall back in. And it's really hugging the thing. Uh, I mean, I gotta go down and see if it destroyed something else. From here, it looks pretty good, right? I don't see any breaks on the platform itself. It just broke that wall on top. And I think I should be able to pull the wall in before finishing up the crane. Yeah, it's pretty good. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it much better. So just 11 logs and 6 rope. That's pretty simple. And then I can just cover this thing up. The cannibals still have some room to pass through. Yeah. But just to be sure, I'm going to save right now. And start building the crane after I save. If it doesn't work, I can always come back. Before going to sleep, let's see if I can actually put the wall in. It could, it should be easier to just do it like this, and I can just, uh, yeah, but it's gonna be tricky to delete the other ones behind the storage. Yeah, this is gonna be a little tricky. Put the wall in, and in reality, I don't actually need to finish it, I don't actually need to close it, but I would like to. Let's see if I can see. Yeah, it's kind of hard. Does it snap? It kind of feels like it's snapping. I mean, it kind of looks okay. I just hope the crane works and uh, doesn't bang and gets stuck on one of the, the beams. Yeah, but I just save a little bit before. I'm gonna sleep, start building this thing, and then let's see if it works. Yeah, but it's uh, getting pretty late, so I'm gonna go back. Holy moly, the SNM guys on my base. What do you want? Oh man, these guys are really tough. They're strong and they're weird as fuck. There you go, at least the small guy is out. This is the, mo the most dangerous guy, I feel. The little ones are the most dangerous. Where? I hear another one. I don't see him though. And I think it's a little bit early. The big guy went down, but uh, I think it was another... Yeah. Should be okay. We got some bones on me. No. I didn't actually burn the pile downstairs. Downstairs. Down there next to the lake. Uh, there was a lot of them and I didn't have any room to collect the bones. 
So that's fine. There should be more cannibals in the near future. So I actually managed to sleep and wake up uh, during daytime. I didn't go to sleep too early. And the fellows are still here. So I got this new thing. I feel that. There you go. The flare went all the way there. What the. Oh, that's a bird. But he actually burned where he hit. So that's pretty sweet. I also found another cool place really close to me with a bunch of yellow boxes with arrows and flares. And that was pretty sweet. That's basically where I'm looking at. Okay, so let's start building it. So I got three ropes. Uh, I think I'm gonna get more ropes. And in fact, I should be able to get also a little bit more cloth. I got 35 arrows. So let's actually see, because I found that area that I'd said before. And I haven't checked if it responds as the arrows can do. So let me just check on my stats. Oh yeah, doing good. So let's go right there. It was pretty cool. I just happened to find it uh, by, by accident. Because I was looking for plants, cone flower. I went next to that lake where I got the fish trap. And I happened to find those little yellow boxes. So since I'm here, let's just grab a little bit more. There should be chicory around here somewhere. There you go. There's some chicory. And crocodiles too, so let's zip it. Okay, so I'm gonna have to recover the stamina. Yeah. So here's the lake where I put my fish trap and where you usually I come to get some cold flower. And there's also chicory and aloe here. And the fish trap is still nothing. I'm gonna have to put some more and see how it actually works. So, if we can... Oh! Don't mind if I do. I'm still full on lizards. I forgot to make another giant wreck for lizard skins. But lizard skins are not that useful. They're just for stealth armor. And I don't usually use it, so that's fine. Okay, so there's some aloe. Some aloe, some gold flower. And aloe, actually. There you go. So, it's somewhere up here. It's on that hill. It's on this little rocky outgrow. Uh, whatever you call it. There you go. They, and they respawn. Look at that. So it's much closer, but the flares don't. See where I am. So the sinkhole is right there. My base is somewhere behind here, in this direction. Uh, and uh, it's much closer than the arrows camp. So whenever I need arrows, I can just come here. But in fact, I'm going to go to my little outpost. Because I want to retrieve some cloth, and there should be sticks with clo with clo uh, with cloth there. No sticks with with skulls. I don't know what you call it. And uh, in terms of plants, I'm actually doing okay. I'm full on meds. Yeah, I don't really need to go right now. I'm just gonna waste time. I'm gonna change plants. I'm gonna go back. Oh, but the rope. God damn it! I almost forgot. I need the rope. So where can I get rope? Out there, next to my outpost, there should be two ropes right there. And there it is. Let's get some cloth. Nice. I also collected a full cannibal. Arms, legs and head. And there's a um, an achievement of this game to actually eat a full cannibal. But I'm not sure if I should cook them or dry them. So I'm just going to put them in a dry rack. And uh, let them dry. And then let's see if it actually is it tasty or not. So I got a couple arms. <laughs> this is some sick shit. But uh, there you go. Let's grab some more meat. This is all dry. Nice. I'm not going to save. I'm having a lot of work. And probably all of this is not going to be useful. Because if the crane doesn't work, I'm going to have to go back to a previous save. But at least I got two ropes right here, so it should save me some cloth. Let's get a little bit more. I think I already installed uh, three, so I got two. I only need one. So it's seven cloth. Should be pretty much what I'm collecting here. So, yeah. It should be a little far to be able to get another rope. What I could do is just save and reload the game, but that's something I don't want to do right now. Let me actually go back here because sometimes this stick responds. And I'm close. And it didn't. So yeah. let me just get back out and finish off the crane. And once I come to this outpost again, I'm gonna eat a full cannibal. 
Oh yeah. Not looking forward to it, but I'd definitely like to see if the achievement works. Okay, so let's just build this thing. I just need another rope. There you go, you know nine more logs. Uh let's build the crane first before the wall. And it's pretty cool having this storage right here. I think it was a good idea. It's helpful. Just one more. And there you go. And it should be downstairs, right? I think it should. So let's try to build a wall. I think it's just one and not two sections. Let's see. Yeah, it's just one section. And it worked out pretty well. Okay, so now I'm gonna go down and let's see if also not only he doesn't bang against the beams of the platform. If actually it lines up well with the first floor. That would be kinda cool. I didn't bring sticks, that's fine. Let's go up. Okay, so far so good. Yeah. It's pretty high. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh boy, that was awesome. Okay, I gotta do a little bit of a jump to go in. But that's really good, man. That's spectacular. And now when I'm gonna go down, I just... And get out. And there you go. I just have to line it up well. And I don't even fall in between the thing. It's pretty safe. And I can actually, maybe I'm gonna try to do a railing. I know I can put some bog holders on this thing. But I don't know if I can actually put stick fences. Uh, let's see. Where are the stick? There they are. Can I put them on this thing? Doesn't look like it. Oh, I can. Over there it says I can. Oh, but now I can't. Now I can. But it doesn't go. It's not red. Let's see, what if I go all the way up? Let's try now. Now, what about uh, rock fences, rock wall? <laughs> that would be awesome. What's C? Oh, C is to do this like that. This will actually pretty look pretty cool. But because... Well, this is not a bad idea actually, because this can be open. I don't mind if it rains, because I'm gonna have drying racks here, I'm gonna have a garden. Basically, the food is going to be on this top level. What else would I need? A little bedroom for a bed? Really? I could just put a bed right there and should be fine. A campfire? Yeah, it would be nice. I could just cover up this part. But, you know what? I'm going to put this in. And if I don't like it, it's just going to uh, take a lot of stones. Holy moly. Just gonna take these little bits here and then I'll just cover up. But yeah, I think, and I'm probably gonna open up this one so that I can actually exit still this way. But this worked out. The crane, I think, was a great idea. The thing is, if I go around, I think I can bring the rope. Let's say the the the, the platform is right here, and I end up myself down down there fighting some cannibals. I think I can pull the rope down. Let's try. No, I cannot. So, in case I end up right here and the platform is up there, I gotta go run. But that's okay. Uh, that's okay because... And the same thing applies if I come down with the platform, I'm not gonna be able to use it from up there. Uh, that's good to know, but I think this is helpful. This is gonna work. Because I'm probably mostly going to use it just to go from the ground floor to the top floor. So, actually coming down here is just going to be once in a while if I have to wash myself or something. Because this is going to be actually closed. I'm going to close this off with defensive walls and just put a gate. And uh, it should be pretty good. But it worked. My crane is looking massive and I got myself a nice little connection to the first floor.
Thank you for watching and until next time.